Many people applying for assistance through FEMA find the process of filling out the application difficult and confusing. With FEMA centers available in nearly every flood-affected county, assistance through the application process is not hard to find. It, it is a government program and it does require completing an application. It can be done online at uh, disasterassistance.gov or with a telephone number that I've got right here. It's 1-800-621-3362. Uh, if people have trouble with making the application or after they've had it they have questions or don't understand or there's some something that doesn't seem to to be uh, the way it ought to be one of the things that they can do is to come into the disaster recovery center that we have right here in the Knott County Sportsplex. With recent claims made that FEMA is denying too many requests for assistance, many may feel discouraged with beginning the application process. However, many services are provided by the FEMA recovery centers that can greatly assist in the confusing process. We can help them make a registration right up front if that's what they need to do. If they've already made a registration and they have questions, maybe they've got a letter they don't understand or something like that, uh, we can look up their file in our computer and uh, tr explain to them what the letter really means. It's all in our hands, this life of time that's given to us all. It is all in our hands, it is all in our hands. Experienced heart specialist and subspecialist collaborating for the benefit of your care. Top 10% national hospital rankings for patient safety in heart attack and heart failure treatment. The technology and skill to perform extraordinary complex, minimally invasive cardiac, electrophysiology, interventional and structural heart surgeries. This is the Heart and Vascular Institute at Pikeville Medical Center. It is all in our hands, it is all in our hands. When it comes to your heart, place your care in our hands. Even two weeks after the flooding disaster, the FEMA Recovery Center in Knott County is receiving a steady flow of individuals coming to seek help in the application process. Since we've been in this center, and we've been, this, this particular center, Disaster Recovery Center, has been open about a week, and actually it's been very consistent. We're having between 50 and 60 people a, a day coming in. Some of them have already applied uh, and are coming in because they're doing follow-up on their application, just what I explained, maybe bringing in paperwork or something. And other people are actually uh, applying, but there's still a lot of applications coming in. It's, it's not going down, you know, the numbers are not going down. It, it, there was, of course, always in any disaster, there's an immediate uh, number of people who step up to get their application in but there's still a lot of people and there are a lot of people out there who do need to apply. Those in need of aid are heavily encouraged to visit a FEMA recovery center for any help they need in the application process. The FEMA recovery center located in the Knott County Sportsplex is open 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. Monday through Saturday and 1 p.m. to 7 p.m. on Sundays. For Mountaintop News, I'm Kelsey Dean.